Pat. I'm Jim. I'm Dave. Let's drink some wine. Park Farm Winery. Where are we? In the production room. <laughs> <laughs> We've re-released our La Crescent now as Daisy Girl. It's Ooh. a sweet summer, laying in the pool, eating fruit, drink by the bottle, wonderful wine. Daisy is, uh, she's my emotional hound dog. Yeah, we got a, a number of dogs running around. Daisy was, she was actually, I used to foster for the Humane Society, and she was my first foster dog, and I went to go pick her up, and she ran down the hallway and tackled me. She was about eight months old, and I said, I don't think I can take her back. This is a, uh, you know, we talk about Eclipse is our dry version of La Crescent. Um, Daisy Girl would be our sweet version. Yeah, it just, it lends itself more towards a, a sweeter wine. But the acids are higher, so you have to balance that somehow, and yeah. we do that with sugar. But because those acids are high, even though it does have that sweetness, it still has a crispness to it. There's a, this one is a, has a lot of apricot, kind of ripe, really ripe tropical fruit. I guess would be a good way to describe it. You could drink it on its own or with like a fresh fruit salad. I just cut a melon in half, put an umbrella in there, pour some La Crescent in, big, big old straw, lay in the pool. Daisy Girl is probably closest to a Moscato. Yeah, it's got the really like intense fruit. I mean, you can say like, oh, now that you say that, I pick up a little bit of that. Well, the Crescent's like fruit bomb in your face. So you want to, if you just want that really intense fruit flavor, Daisy Girl. We're drinking um, La Crescent. Daisy Girl. Daisy, Daisy Girl. Yep.